back again with another episode of Live Alive. We have our characters. I went there and did some leveling uh, off screen with Sundown to get them up to 16 so we could get Hurricane unlocked. So this time, his fight against uh, El Dio, or oh gosh, uh, not El Dio, the, uh, the Gatling gun guy. This should go a lot better this time. Like, oh my god, nothing more frustrating than getting there to that guy only to be just absolutely blown up by the Gatling gun. Ay, ay, ay. But, yeah, let's see what happens. Alright, we don't need to see this. We've seen all this before. We don't need to see this. to see that. Need to see that. found a lot of, uh, gosh, the, uh, robotic enhancements for, uh, Cube, so we were able to get Cube, like, leveled up a lot, so that felt good. enough of a heal. Oh 
got to get uh, 100 retreats. Flowers to the wind. Yeah, we've seen all these fights, we know what we gotta do. He actually hit me this time. Cast on, flowers to the wind. Just remember, just use Come on, Let's do this! Raise him! You've lasted longer than I thought! Gonna use a good <laughs> kick, that's fine. Now you gotta come over to us. This thing got off, right? right? When I have a Gatling attack, not fun. So the first thing we want to do, take out the arms.
Why? Why, why, why? Why can we not prevail? What have you that we lack? What secret strength? So we gotta take out the hands first, then it's gonna come to the sin of Odio. <laughs> mountain trembles. An earthquake. It's growing. Thicker and more potent. He's calling it to him. All the darkness. All the hatred in this world. So it's not over, huh? Not, not by a long shot. into land it's gonna help a lot if you can't it is what it is I 
think he's going to tie up our team now, and then the uh, other party members are going to join. I will! 
I say it's heavenly strike that we use. I got you. Um, there we go. And that is live alive. True ending. This boss is a heck of a lot easier than the uh, other Cinevodio that you have to fight. Oh my gosh, at least you're not being fed a mist fest. Uh, that's what I hate against about that one boss. Hey Vash. Forgotten name. Remembered now. Yes. Yes. Now all we gotta do is fight that last boss where we gotta run away from a hundred battles. Are these my hands? Stained black with blood and sin. What wickedness I've wrought. And all for what? Hey, piglet. Nay, this love. <laughs> A boundless love. I wanted that once. Once upon a time. Your return is nigh. My magic wanes as life and time remaining ebb. Let not this memory fade. My words preserve. In every heart, the seed of dark abides. No, stop, cat. The makings of a oh, lord, don't, don't claw me. when watered well, with hate, sweet yeah, hate, hurts when you dig your claws into she springs head. eternal, sings, all tempting draught, will drink of her again. Every heart, the seed of dark abides. The makings of a lord when watered well with hate, sweet hate, she springs eternal, sings all tempting draught will drink of her again. Oh, hopefully not. I'll remember your words, and my Shifus as well. Come what may, I'll look after my people. I still have faith. One day the Take sun shall rise. Words. One day we will greet a new dawn. 
About time we got out of here. <laughs> I'm starting to get homesick. Us. Guess I'll have to pick up from where I left off. By Masaru. Looking for the next mountain to climb. Whatever happens, we'll survive. That's Your what we do. Your ultimate is amazing, Sundown. That's why you want to get 16 with Sundown, because, oh my god. Yeah, Barrel's waiting for you, Pogo. Go get her. has been lifted. Chasing after a sundown. <laughs> I do like that one. Is that all you have inside of your apartment? That's what I was always curious about.
watch this. <laughs> Gory and Beru. Not like that, though. Yep, they had a little kid. <laughs> yeah, look at this. Good game, good game. If you're a fan of like the old school JRPGs, you know, from uh, the Super Nintendo, I'd highly recommend scooping this game up. It can be a bit of a pain in the butt to go through to get all the endings, but it's worth it. It's worth it. Nothing, I wouldn't say that there's anything really difficult about this game except for uh, leveling up. Once your characters get to a certain point, it can be a bit of a grind, but once you start getting those level 16 abilities, like Hurricane for uh, Sundown, yeah, it's totally worth it. And with some of my characters, I try and grind a little more just so we can improve their accuracy and their evasion. Anything that helps against that last boss, and not so much the last boss for the true ending, but the last boss that you gotta fight before you get there because oh my god is that one cheap. <laughs> but it's totally doable. It's fair. Ugh, I hate that man. If I only could have got that cola bottle. Oh my god, man. Every time you use it, it does 999 damage. Or somewhere as close to that. That would help a lot against so many of the enemies that we would have been fighting there. still do got uh, one last ultimate boss that we gotta go through and beat, but that's not gonna be too difficult. Like I said, the hardest part's gonna be running away constantly, because I think that we still got like quite a few running aways that we gotta do. surprised that we got that ability so early. I figured that would be the one that I wouldn't be able to get, but instead it was the one from the old guy. Imagine. Go figure. That fight was pretty good.
but I'm thinking for our next game. Gosh. I do want to get back to chain decals and start knocking that out. And we're really close to finishing off uh, Assassin's Creed. Like I said, all it is is just going through each of the regions, getting the tattoos, finishing up the quest, uh, Roman artifacts, all that, and then we're done with that one. So we should be... I'm hoping to be able to have both of these games platinumed uh, within like this week. There are some games that I was playing that I'd like to get back to. Definitely One Piece. Um, Final Fantasy Strange of Paradise. I'd really like to get back to that game. Tales of Cold Steel 2. I want to do that. Let me see what else. Oh gosh. I do want to do the uh, Final Fantasy 7. Like, I got uh, both of them the uh, prequel. And I got the remake, or the remaster, I want to get back into that, add that to my uh, other Final Fantasy games that I have on uh, my channel. But yeah, there's a lot of games that I still have that I want to go through, make some guides, show you guys how to go through, get them beat, go for the platinum and all that. be a lot easier, uh, oh gosh, once summer is here, I'll have a bit more free time, but I do plan on taking some classes just so I can, like, uh, get my master's a lot sooner, so that way I can make a little more money, and that help a lot just with some of the plans that, some of the things that I'd like to do. But I also like to be out here being able to play video games show you guys some of what it is that I like to do. Let me tell you stories about my cats and how they're always getting into stuff. <laughs> Hello, sorry for bothering you. I want to offer promotion of the channel, video, viewers, banners, viewers, chatbots, etc. The place is slower than the... Hmm. I might think about that. Hey, Piglet. There we go. But that is live alive. Once I finally get the, uh, the one boss that you gotta run away from in the that timeline like a hundred times, I'll, I'll show you guys the boss fight. It's probably not gonna be very long. Like, I... I I think with uh, any of my characters, like, we'd be able to blow it up, like, really quick. All it is is just, like, a saber tooth tiger. Once you get to, like, 95 times where you run away, then it starts sending you a warning, like, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, then it comes out and it fights you. Assassin's Creed, get the platinum for that one. Oh, Sakura of Rice and Rain. I do gotta get back to that game too. I'd like to get that knocked out. Got a decent amount of games to go through. But I, yeah, I do plan on doing some videos for all of them, showing how to get them done. But this was a fun one. It was a game that was near and dear to me. Not quite like uh, Chrono Trigger, but, you know, still a good one. Still a really good one. I really do hope that, if, even if we don't get a remaster of Chrono Trigger, if they put like a version where we can actually play it on the PS4 or play a PS5, that'd be nice. It was nice to go through all the old school Final Fantasy games like Six, be able to get those knocked out. Like, playing three, it was my first time ever playing that game, you know, other than just reading about it, so that was pretty fun. 
especially once we got the uh, ninja and the sage class unlocked. It's funny how much they uh, buffed up the ninja class. Like having the thief in your party, if luck and everything would have worked the way that you know they had planned it to, from like all the stories that I'd read about, like production for Final Fantasy One, that would have been interesting. But thief versus black belt, you know, or ninja versus master. Yeah, I'm sorry. There's just no comparison. It's master all the way. Your master black belt easily eclipses thief. And then you can have your uh, red mage in there, red wizard. That can be your healer, so no sense having like the uh, white mage, white wizard. Then for magic, you got the black mage, black wizard. And you can always pop in some offensive spells with your uh, red mage as well, and yeah. I like the versatility of the Red Mage in Final Fantasy 1. Final Fantasy 2, once I like figured everything out, like with the uh, weapon upgrading to get your skills up to 16, of course you want to have like the weaker uh, equipment like equipped on your character so that way you can still gain points for it, otherwise with all that high level stuff you kill it thing just way too fast. <laughs> but it does feel good. We added another game to the list. Go through, get this one platinum, and it'll be a good day. How many times have we got to run away? That's going to be the grind. Uh, figuring out how many more of those that we gotta go through. It would be nice to go back and finish out uh, uh, Fallout 4. Like, I got uh, three or four different save files saved at the point, like the point of no return. Like, one where I can go through, get everything done for the Institute, one for the railroad. One for the Minutemen, uh, one for the Brotherhood of Steel. It'd be nice to be able to see all of those endings. I might have to put, like, start doing Fallout 4. Like, that'd be nice to show that. I know it's an old game, but I still love it. Really fun. Where, I really wish I would have been streaming at the time, like, my playthrough for, uh, Spider-Man and, uh, Assassin's Creed Origins and Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Those were some fun games to play. I think the last trophy I got for Assassin's Creed Odyssey, the Exploration one, there is an itty bit of land that I hadn't seen that was still foggy on, uh, Peloponnesian Peninsula. I was like, seriously? That's what it was that kept me from getting the trophy? Go figure. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope to catch you on the next one. Take care.